Hi, Mike's, Mike from uh, Mike's Carburetor Parts, and I'm in the process of uh, doing a series of videos for the uh, Holly 1904 rebuild, and uh, I'm down to uh, getting ready to put the float bowl together, but I'm going to put this uh, together here, and um, let's see, the first thing is, uh, let's see, i got to see which check ball goes where, and uh, I can see easily that i got a big one here, and i got a small seat in this one. It's easy to tell. So uh, I got my small check ball here. I put it in here. Uh, there's a weight that goes in here, and uh, then I have the plug. I believe it's this one. Okay. The bigger plug goes in here, or a bigger check ball, I should say. Hmm. A little cup came out of something. Let's see. Was it this carburetor? I'll check that later. Okay. Um, all right. They rattle good. They're loose. Uh, this is your main jet, main jet well, um, and this is your uh, power. Uh, oh, what do you call it? It's uh, it's uh, I forget what you call it, but your your economizer here when it comes down um, at higher speeds pushes that in, allows more fuel come from the float bowl in through the uh, main jet well okay so let's put oh, I'll have to get some I'll have to get some more parts here all right I'm gonna put the uh, solar pump diaphragm together spring goes over here we have this cylinder that goes over the shaft like a so you got to line it up with this uh, notch right here that's where the check ball is going to sit into that's what's going to hold it together as a check ball and so we'll get that together and we'll try and keep it from uh, popping off and flying across the room I'll we'll get my little check ball in here it's another one of the small ones and there we go and uh, okay, gotta check it out. I don't like that noise. Now these don't move much. They don't move the full length of that check. They just just about this much right here. All right, I'm gonna spray it with silicon spray lubricant. These things really get uh, stiff in there. Okay, slides right down in there like that, like so. Okay, and uh, then we got our spring that goes on here like a so. Put this end in first. Okay, we got uh, we got the long screws. These are like number fours. I think they're smaller than us. Yeah, maybe they're a six. Then we got these short screws that go down in this in the ends. Let's get them started here. Hold this together.
Okay, I don't uh, tighten all this stuff as tight as I can get it. Just snug them down good. All right, we'll do our economizer diaphragm here. Uh, get it lined up with the holes. And uh, so the way this goes is, uh, first of all, you got to match up uh, your holes here. Uh, this is vacuum operated. Make sure you're all nice and clear and, and got it all blowed out. Okay. You have a gasket here that goes on first because otherwise you'd have metal to metal here. Now theoretically, uh, except when you're up in a hill and whatnot, gas is not going to come out here because the gas isn't that high up in the float bowl. Okay, so you put your gasket on, you put this on, straight down, put your three screws in. i got to find some new screws. So Now you see how it uh, fits right here on that little peg? So at idle, uh, by default, you see it's pushed, uh, excuse me, when there's no vacuum, it's got to push down. Now, at low, very low speed and at idle, uh, it's going to pull this thing up and uh, cut off the uh, fuel from flowing in here. And then as you uh, press on the accelerator, as you, uh, of course, when you first press on the accelerator, you get a little spurt from your accelerator pump. But after that, you still need a bigger volume of fuel flowing uh, at high speeds. So this thing, with your, uh, at high speeds, your carburetor has less vacuum, and this thing will fall down. Uh, due to the spring here that will help push it down. Open up this uh, 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 little shaft here, push down on it, and let your gas flow. And so that's what that's all about. So I'm going to stop the video here, and uh, we'll make an, the next uh, video and we'll put, probably put the rest of it together uh, since I got a, uh, I'm never prepared for these videos. And uh, <laughs> so I'm going to have to go, I'm gonna, I like to put new screws on these. So uh, I'm going to do that, but uh, basically get the idea of that part of it. So I'll be back. Thanks for watching.